Too much gambling here. So Siakam gambles once, doesn't get it. Now let's just play defense. There's only 2.4 seconds left on the shot clock. Nope, Siakam's going to try and gamble again. So now Siakam, look at this. As opposed to just having his hands up with nine-tenths of a second left on the shot clock, you gamble on a swipe down, and now this shot gets off somehow. Just effort here. This shot goes up. If you're Pascal Siakam, sprint back. Let's check in on that effort level. Wow, is that unbelievable. I guess you want to be the team that lets the Pistons win a game. Scotty Barnes is switching on to Jalen Duran here. You got to switch with a lot more urgency. Like, I got to be over now, battling for position now. Look at how lazy this switch is. What is, look at this. Why is Jalen Duran have inside position on you? If you're Dennis Schroeder, as Cade Cunningham cuts through, my back is always to the baseline. I'm always seeing ball and seeing man. Look at Dennis Schroeder. <clears throat> back to the sideline. So now Cade Cunningham's catching this. You're not ready to guard. This draws help. Easy put back. Darko Ryakovich should have to walk back to Toronto. This is a disgrace. The sideline's right here. Hedge this screen. Dennis Schroeder can get in backside help. The sideline's right there. The second Cade Cunningham hesitates, which is going to have to be in like a tenth of a second, I can bump Schroeder back and recover. But nope, let's give Cade Cunningham the lane. Now you've got to contest at the rim for no reason, and there's no one left to box out Durin. This is just the Raptors being poorly coached. Otto Porter right here, you're getting in the gaps. First of all, I'm up the line. My feet are set. I'm in a defensive stance. I'm stunting. I'm recovering. You're not up the line. You're going towards the ball on the kickout. Not getting out in time for no reason. Same exact thing. Darko Ryakovic should not be coaching another basketball game. Chris Boucher, up the line, feet set, defensive stance so I can stunt and recover. You're going going towards the ball on the kickout. Pump fake, drive two. So the Raptors are in their idiot drop coverage. What is Pascal Siakam doing? Chris Boucher is coming over to help. Could you get up the line and be ready to guard Bogdanovich? Why is Siakam dropping into the paint right here? It's not Bogdanovich catching this. Again, you're not ready to guard. Rip and go, drop it, Wiseman. Darko Ryakovich, his employment in basketball is a disgrace to the game. It's a disgrace to fans. Ice this screen, please. Keep Bogdanovich towards the sideline. There's no place for Wiseman to roll. Scotty Barnes in backside help. Look at this pick and roll defense. This is how you lose to a team that lost 28 straight. Look at that. Just Bogdanovich in the lane, open instantly. What a circus the Raptors are. Why is Darko Ryakovich in the league? Okay, Jaco Portal's not going to be able to get to Jalen Duran. So cross matches happen all the time. Schroeder's going to have to take Jalen Duran. Pirtle's going to have to go over to Kevin Knox. And Pascal Siakam has got to get back and actually be ready to guard. But Pascal Siakam's stopping at half court right here, backpedaling. No one, Jaco Pirtle's still trying to get to Duran. They're going to run into each other in a clown car. Again, the Raptors are in their idiot drop coverage. Scotty Barnes comes over to help right here, okay? But once this dribble gets picked up, if you're Scotty Barnes, again, up the line. But this dribble's picked up now, okay? So now there's nothing to help. Just get back to Jalen Duran. Like, now you're just standing around doubling for absolutely no reason. So Duran can just get it and go. Why are the Raptors putting on a full court press trapping like this is high school basketball? Can Dennis Schroeder just get back and be ready to guard? Scotty Barnes, back and be ready to guard and be in the gaps and help. Instead, Dennis Schroeder, you're going to end up trapping here. Okay, fine. Well, now Pascal Siakam's got to rotate. You got to rotate to one pass away. Otto Porter, one pass away. But no one rotates. What is this, high school? Like, pfft. Just look at this defense. Darko Ryakovich should not be allowed to coach another game. I, of course, would ice this screen because Jalen Duren has no place to roll to. What even is this ball screen defense? What is Jakob Pertl doing? What a disaster the Raptors are. This is just effort. Why is Dennis Schroeder not sprinting back here? Look at Dennis Schroeder. Why are you not getting back? You're jogging back. It's a three on two now. Wow. The Raptors are in their idiot drop coverage. So instead of Gary Trent Jr. guarding Jaden Ivey at half court, how about we get in the gaps here so Scotty Barnes can stay home? This is Gary Trent Jr.'s help right here. But Gary Trent Jr. is worried about Jaden Ivey at half court. So now you're, you're not in the gaps at all. That, that's Darko Ryakovich being awful. Now Scotty Barnes has to come help and Bogdanovich is left open. 
on this switch if you're Siakam. Why are you backpedaling? Up. Ready to guard. I have help in the middle of the floor. I'm showing my hands, forcing Cade Cunningham to where my help is. <clears throat> you just backpedal for no reason. And now you're so cooked, it doesn't matter that there's help. Off this cross screen. <clears throat> How many times you got to make that sound? No, if you're Posca, I'm underneath Bogdanovich. He's setting a cross screen. My ba I'm always in front of my man. But now on this cross screen, I can jam Jalen Dern as he comes through so Jakob Pertl can get on the other side. But you're fronting Bogdanovich like he's Shaq. And pfft. Oscar Siakam, could you keep your head on a swivel away from the ball, seeing ball, seeing man, this Raptors team. Look at Pascal Siakam staring at the ball, staring at the ball, staring at the ball, staring at the ball, beat back door. You get cross-matched all the time in transition. That's transition defense. Jalen McDaniels has got to sprint back. He's got to take James Wiseman so Chris Boucher can stay focused on the basketball. Okay? But instead, look what happens. You're having Chris Boucher guard two people for no reason. So now he's going to be late getting to Wiseman. Easy seal. Over the top. Catch. Dunk. You certainly don't need to switch this handoff right here. McDaniels can take a step back and let Scotty Barnes through. But again, if you're switching this handoff... Every single time Jalen McDaniels and Scotty Barnes are a part of a ball screen or handoff, you're switching because you're not thinking about it. See, Scotty Barnes doesn't know if he should switch or not. So now he's going to be late switching onto Bogdanovich right here, and Bogdanovich is just going to be able to get right over the top and go. The shot goes up. Look at Gary Trent Jr. here. Why are you not boxing out the shooter? Why is nobody else? Why is Dennis Schroeder, of all people, the only one boxing out? You have four reps. Gary Trent Jr. is staring at the ball. Like, you, you want to be in the stands? Like, you can stare at the ball there, too. On this handoff, Dennis Schroeder needs to be going under. You meet Cade Cunningham on the other side. You go over the top. Now you're screened. And this is a layup line. Darko Ryakovich is awful. Okay, so the Pistons run consecutive ball screens right here. Okay, so Gary Trent Jr. switching on to Cade Cunningham. Why is Dennis... You're not a part of this ball screen. Stay with Jaden Ivey. Look at this. Gary Trent Jr. switching. So is Dennis Schroeder. What? Darko Ryakovich. The Raptors are in a zone. It's a circus because everything with the Raptors is a circus. G Jakob Pertl's got to take the middle of the zone, okay? Gary Trent Jr. is responsible for the wing in the zone. Why is he guarding the ball? That's Dennis Schroeder's area of the zone. So you got two people guarding the ball for no reason. Then you have Jakob Pertl standing around thinking it's okay to just guard air. So now Dennis Schroeder had to drop into the paint to guard the middle of the zone. So he's not going to be ready to guard Cade Cunningham. And then to top it all off, Pascal Siakam somehow doesn't get over and get in the gap, stunt, recover, get the dribble picked up. Darko Ryakovich should not be allowed to coach another game.